Mike Woods here for the Boxing Channel. We're in New York City and we're looking ahead to an April 19th clash in DC. The ageless one, 49 years old, Bernard Hopkins, light heavyweight champion, going up against another 175 pound titleist, Beba Chumanov. So here at BB Kings, the principals gathered and let's hear what they had to say. Anytime Bernard fights, it is, is an event. It's an occasion in history at the Capitol is a very accurate term. We have a young, hungry, strong challenger and a champion in his own right. Um, and I would you know, dare to say that he's gonna be one of the toughest challengers that Bernard has faced in quite a while. Speaking of uh, Bernard Hopkins, he's a boxing genius. He's a legend who beat so many other legends. He's, he's got highest boxing IQ and he's got highest uh, boxing skill level. Uh, and uh, I'm very excited that I'm fighting with uh, one of the greatest fighters ever. And that's a way for me to show the world that I'm the best light heavyweight champion in the world. Don't miss out April 19th. It will be a historic event. I'm so blessed to be able to be in position with a young, strong, credible, believing he can win, signed up for a fight that others ain't kicking the door down to fight a 49-year-old man. Let's be honest, y'all. Nobody kicking the doors down to fight Bernard Hopkins. But he stepped up, and you have to say to himself, or at least I have to say, been through this many times in my life with fighting guys that's obviously younger than me, going back to even the Tito Trinidad. He was calling me old at 35. Do the math. 2001, I'm 49. Subtract that, 35 years old. He was calling me old then. I never let people dictate to me that I come up in the ghetto, so I must think ghetto. I come up in the urban city, so I must think that this is where my destiny and where I live and then I die. That I shouldn't want better. I shouldn't want to do better because it's the norm. Well, I'm not that. And I want to prove until I leave this game. And I will leave on my terms, but I won't leave in an embarrassment term. I promise you that. Father Tom understands that, you know what, Bernard? You don't drink, you haven't drank, you haven't drunk anything in almost three decades. You took care of your body, you took care of yourself. You got one of the best superior defense, along with, again, you could say Floor Mayweather and myself. We haven't been tapped on, hit on, beat on. We talk well, we speak well, we take care of our lives. So at the end of the day, Father Tom says to me, we talk every now and then. Have fun. You got time. Well, everybody's asking me about my age because their stomach is out this big. <laughs> because they eating bagels. They ain't drinking wine. Enjoy yourself. That's what you want to do. But when you see me, <laughs> don't be envy. Be motivated. Be energized. Woman or man. And say to yourself, how can I start to be like him? How can I take a page out of his book and have a long life and play with my grandkids for some? And so for me, I say to you, when you see me April 19th in DC on Showtime, be inspired. Be inspired that if you're near 40, if you're over 40, over 50, over 60, be like, man, it's never too late to change your lifestyle. Bernard Hopkins, motivational speaker extraordinaire, has a six pack that put all of us to shame. Looking ahead to the April 19th clash, Hopkins still fit and fiery against a 30 year old challenger. Can he do it again? Looking forward to the April 19th clash in DC. Mike Woods for the Boxing Channel. Thanks for watching.